Hi. Um, I feel like it's been more days than usual since I vlogged. Um, I've been keeping myself more busy. Um, probably sound less sick. Um, I feel, I feel optimistic today. Um, reached out to uh, people. Posted on Instagram with like. Satan was a low key cry for help. Honestly, less people. <laughs> I don't know if less pe the the people who reached out to me, um, I guess were people I didn't expect as much. Um, especially um, especially someone who I hadn't talked to in a long time. To be honest, I think I've only met her in person twice. Um, she was a friend of my ex's. Um, but we bonded over shared existential dread basically um yeah so that that was that was pretty nice um i i posted um basically you know how i was feeling and how i think i i need reminders that this is temporary and that i'm cared about and that i'm loved i i'm not feeling I, w I was never feeling in a way that I wasn't loved um that was never what I was kind of struggling with whether I was loved but in writing that post and thinking about why I was writing that post um I think it's because I wanted um I wanted to remember that that people care about me that and that I have value and that I bring value to, to people's lives um I, I guess it makes life seem less hopeless if i am bringing value um because that is meaning right um i'm i'm doing something meaningful by existing if i am bringing value to someone's life um I, uh couple other things um today i asked um my friends to play played up with me which is a game that i used to like i like i love that game like i would force my friends to play it and i would play it by myself single player um and it, it could be very intense um and require a lot of focus and i i think i kind of needed that i also felt like it was less um hand intensive like less um like apm than um, say leagues or Valorant. Um, one thing though was that I was using a controller. I'm always pressing my thumb. So after a few games, like my thumb started hurting. Um, I played a couple more after it started hurting. I know I shouldn't have, but like, um, I felt like we were almost done. Um, hopefully that doesn't bite me in the end. But it was just like a couple more games. Uh, I switched from controller to my keyboard. Tried to put my wrist in a different position. So um. Hopefully that helps. And oh man, I started just regular vlogging. I forgot why I wanted to make this video in the first place. Um, <clears throat> so I, I guess I'll start there. Um, so I wanted to talk to Janelle tomorrow morning because the mornings have been the hardest this week. I always wake up crying or wanting to cry or needing to call someone. Um, I had to call what's called a hot a warm line. It's like a hotline, but not quite for emergencies. But you just need someone to talk to. I called someone um that I used to um be friends with, who I knew um has struggled like very very much with depression and anxiety, um, and I just. I felt like I needed to I'm totally off topic. I'm not on my ADHD meds, but um I, I felt like I I needed to talk to someone who I know has been there and presumably is not there. Like I know she has been there and wasn't always there. Um and I, I needed to ask someone why they haven't given up basically 
when when they have felt that low and how they keep themselves from giving up. Um, that was all just a tangent based on the fact that my mornings have been the worst and I cry a lot in the mornings. Um, so yeah, I wanted to <laughs> make a video for Janelle tomorrow morning. Um, so right now, right now it's hard and you're probably impatient because I paused a lot saying right now. Um, but I know you know this. I know you've heard this and, and you know this and it's annoying, but maybe hearing it from me will we'll hit different. You have been happy, right? When you married Monica, that was the best day of your life. And you have video, you have proof of it. And you were very, very happy. And not just for a like 24 hour span, you've been happy for months. You You've done it before. And this is hard, but it's getting better. Like, I I know it, it doesn't feel like that, but it has been getting better since last week. You've You've been through some tough stuff. You've been through some really tough stuff. And I know, I know you're privileged. I know you know you're privileged. But you've also, I've had a hard life and, and, and it sucks. It sucks, and I know, yes, I know some people have had harder lives than you, but you have struggled, you know? And it's tough, and it does suck. And it's okay that it sucks right now, and it's okay to say that it sucks, and it's okay to feel like it sucks, and it's okay that you feel the way you do. It doesn't mean that you're forever broken. It doesn't mean that you're unhealable. You, you, you've been doing a lot of work and this step backwards doesn't mean you're start starting from ground zero, you know, and you're helping, you're helping other people. You're talking to your Ata, you're, you're doing things and you will continue to do things. You will volunteer at mini cat town. You will help those cats. You will will continue to give your dogs a good life that they may not have had without you. You you have done some amazing things and you should be proud of yourself. And I promise it's it, it, it will end. This this feeling it will end and you will start looking forward to things again. You know what's crazy? Looking at the camera and not at my own reflection makes me actually feel like I'm talking to a different person. And that's why it doesn't feel as, like, dumb. <laughs> like, the idea that I'm talking to someone objectively versus, like, to myself. Because, like, I, I want to say all these things to myself now. It just sounds really stupid. Like, it sounds like, nah, bitch. Like, fuck you. You have a pink Tesla. Like, you don't deserve to be the pr See, See what happens when I know I'm talking to myself versus, like, when I really put myself in the space of talking to someone. And, oh, my God, I'm going to depress teacher Janelle. I was, that was a joke. It was a prank. Um, you'll get through today. All right. To all my thousands of viewers out there, I don't know. Why were you listening in on my private conversation with myself? Okay, bye.